grew up Christian but wandered. I found the path of Sikh Dharma through Kundalini Yoga and meditation in a time of personal crisis. The daily practice is more than just going to church on Sundays, which didn't feel like enough for me. Anyone from any tradition can come and visit us at the Gurdwara and be blessed by the Shabad and receive a beautiful meal called Lunger. The food we offer is vegetarian, and that includes people from all faiths. It's another thing that's very empowering for women. It's very democratic and supportive. So after our wedding ceremony, the Lavan, I began wearing the turban full-time and became a Sikh and took my name Shabad Kar Khalsa. The Shabad Guru is the most phenomenal sound technology and it gives me inner peace. His, his hair has never been cut in 15 years. We believe in, in Sikhi that the hair, and it helps us keep our intuition strong. Actually, the Beatles went to India in the 60s to learn philosophy and opened the door to Eastern thought in many ways here in the West. I think Sikhism is a very democratic religion that fits the American culture because it includes everyone to participate.